Welcome to Take Radio. I'm Frank KG5HJ, and today we're going to go over the Hammers application. And Mike, K A M R D, Mike, is going to show us how to export and send those logs into Poda, unlike me, who, you know, forgot to send them for three, four months. We're not talking about that. So play that awesome intro video! <laughs> So down here, this Hammers app, let's open that up. So here's Parks on the Air Activation. Now this one I have not uploaded. See 81 QSOs right here. So we can click on the uh, log here. And these are all the contacts. Notice that it says, enjoy uh, murder mode activated. <laughs> enjoy that 6 dB again. Uh, Jarrett put that little Easter egg in for me. Thank you, Jarrett. It. I love it. So anyway, so these are the, these are the contacts that I made. Now we can click here on QSO map and it'll show us where I was getting to, right? Mm -hmm. So that, and this is real time. Every time I make a QSO, although this is weird because I was way down here in uh, Houston. So that's not accurate. There's, there's some kind of bug with that. We still love it. We still love it. But earlier it said it showed where I was down because I was like right here on the coast of Texas. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, you also have real-time POTA spots. All right, so you can see cards or just table. Fantastic app. Here you put in their call sign. So let's say KG five A H J, and it'll automatically pop up your call sign right there. So you can see who you're working. Now by default. It's going to show just this mode right here. If you hit expanded mode, you can see, oh, that's Frank in Texas. So you can put in over here your, your power. So I usually run 90 watts, your mode. Uh, you can put in your park here, the call sign. If you're using a club, you can put in your grid. Now, if you put what in a- What logging software you, is that? If, <laughs> if you put in your park here, so like kilo, dash uh, three zero one nine it'll automatically populate your grid so this is oh, Huntsville sweet. State Park right there right oh, nice. so this is this is a fantastic app we did not work each other uh, I'm just gonna hit clear here mm -hmm. didn't get each other and I'm gonna go back here to where it says log books so I want to log yeah. this 618 2021 log because I have not uploaded it to the parks on the air so I'm gonna hit this gear right here. So what logging software are you using? <laughs> Jason's a little special. <laughs> Takes him a little longer to catch on. But it's called Hammers. H-A-M-R-S by Jarrett Green. So we're gonna click on this export.adi. Now it's already, it's already named as I want it. So I was at kilo-3013- the year in four digit 2021 and I was there on June 18th. Now I can save this wherever I want. I'm going to save this to my uh, to my desktop and hit save. So now it's already saved there. Let's back up a second though because if I want to create a new logbook, I'm just going to hit new logbook. So let's say I'm at uh, kilo 3019 dash the year 2021 and it is 0626. I feel I need to put my call sign in here too. K8MRD dash. So that's how you create the log. That's what that's what the POTA website wants to see that format. So I can save that. Now when we go back to this ADI, I probably didn't save it right. Uh, it should have my call sign in. Actually, let's go back here. This one right here. So K8 MRD K3019 2021 613. So that was my log for that. So you do need to put your call sign first, then the park designator, then the year, the month, and the date. That's how you should format your logs to submit for POTA. So since I screwed up the other one, we've already fixed it. K8 MRD. I don't know if you get the dashes, but whatever. If you didn't do it right, the admins will let you know you didn't do it right. Even though I'm K8MRD. 
<laughs> They'll let you know. We open up our email. <clears throat> Hopefully there's no porn on it. Anytime now. We go to new. I'm an eight call, so I'm gonna upload it to K8 at Parks on the Air. If you're a five call, you're gonna upload it to K5 at Parks on the Air. So K8 Parks on the Air dot com and I am going to upload that file, which is on my desktop. That one right there, I think, maybe. So now that's there. And then I'm just gonna put K8MRD, K3019, 2021, 0618. I don't know if you really need to put all that stuff in, but I haven't gotten yelled at for them by doing it this way. And then I'll usually put, thanks for what you do, 73, something like that. And then we hit send, and my POTA log is now submitted. That's it. It's that easy? That's, it's that easy. That's what I haven't been doing that for is it. three, four months Can now? you export an ADI and then attach that ADI to an email and hit send? I should be able to. You should be able to. You write code Yes. As for a living. Yes. You make your money Yes. on computers. Yes. Okay. That's all you gotta do, boys. If Frank can't do it, doesn't mean you can't. <laughs> if I can do it, you definitely can. Cause I'm dumber than Frank. Jason can attest to that. Where is he? He's gone. He'll edit that part out. You might not. I don't know.